Item Number SCP-4234 Index Testicles and the sudden lack thereof Anomaly Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures Hereford and Worcester Animal Rescue Center has been relocated to a larger headquarters and L4234 is currently foundation owned under the guise of ongoing construction work. The location is to be operated primarily by sterile male staff members with assistance provided by male D-class personnel. Six non-neutered domesticated dogs are to be housed at the site at all times to prevent manifestations of SCP-4234-1. In the event that SCP-4234-1 instances do manifest, the affected subjects are to be removed, if possible, and placed in storage warehouse 4. Under no circumstances are these items to be viewed by personnel outside of testing. A single instance of SCP-4234 is permanently contained in an incorporeal entity vacuum chamber at Site-33. Testing on this instance is allowed bi-monthly, with permission from Site Director Javier. The instance's physical equivalent has been confirmed non-anomalous, and is currently in the possession of Agent Barrow. Image SCP-4234 Instance Number 205 Description SCP-4234 are ambulatory and intangible manifestations of dogs, Canis familiaris, generated within the former headquarters of Hereford and Worcester Animal Rescue, designated location L4234. SCP-4234 instances are universally identical to a non-neutered male dog present in the building's vicinity, sans testicular organs, and are generated at an average rate of once every 26 days, plus or minus 52 hours. HWAR, a charitable organization dedicated to the collection and rehousing of stray and mistreated dogs. Once generated, SCP-4234 will begin to rapidly move towards their physical counterpart. Although they frequently perform a slow running motion during this time, instances have been observed moving at up to 35 km per hour, and the position of SCP-4234's legs rarely correlates with ground speed. Once within one meter of the non-anomalous dog, SCP-4234 will position itself in the dog's precise spatial location and demanifest, removing the animal's testicles in the process. No canine health defects have ever occurred as a result of SCP-4234 manifestation. Should no dogs be present within the vicinity of L-4234, several instances of SCP-4234-1 will be generated instead. SCP-4234-1 are vaguely canine in shape, but do not correspond to any living dog. Instead, they are visually identifiable only as physical manifestations of the abstract notion of the removal of testicles. SCP-4234-1 are also intangible, but move at a much slower rate than SCP-4234, typically moving by levitating between 0.1 and 3 meters above solid or liquid surfaces. Each SCP-4234-1 will travel sporadically, and after a random amount of time, affix itself permanently to a single entity, be it an object, creature, location, or easily manipulable concept. In cases where the entity possessed testicles, this will simply remove them. However, the vast majority of entities affected by SCP-4234-1 did not originally possess testicles, and now indefinably have fewer than entities not possessing them at all. Currently, such entities include L-4234, 94 non-human animals of various species, 15 motor vehicles, the documentation for SCP-8854, ocular toxoplasmosis within Hereford County Hospital, 96 items of furniture, 144 plants of various species, 34 human females, a single cloud, and three abstract metaphysical containment constructs affected during testing. Long-term sensory exposure to these objects has been found to have a profoundly detrimental effect on the human brain, resulting in existential crises, disillusionment and depression, visual agnosia, hallucinations, and in extreme cases, complete anterograde amnesia regarding all memories not related to testicles.
a proposal made by Dr. Weather to graft testicular organs onto SCP-4234-1 affected entities, potentially neutralizing the conceptual abnormality, is currently under consideration.